Hey guys, it's me. Thanks for coming back to my YouTube channel. If you're not yet subscribed, click on the little subscribe box in the corner and then you can join the family. I just had the best weekend with my twin sister, Allie. As many of you guys know, Allie and I both live in New York City, so we get to hang out all the time. But recently I've been traveling a lot, both for work and for my personal life. This weekend, however, we were able to get together and spend a glorious Saturday afternoon together. It was honestly the best weekend I've had in such a long time. And it's currently Sunday, and guess who's still over and hanging out? Al? Yeah? Can I request your presence for one moment? Yes! Got her. As I was saying, we had the best Saturday together yesterday. We did. And now it's Sunday, and so sadly she's gonna have to leave soon. But before she has to leave, we're making a video. And I partnered up with Wearable X to be able to bring you guys this video where I show you what we did on this amazing Saturday. It all started yesterday morning when Allie came over and we made the most amazing breakfast in the world. Mm. Happy Saturday! Oh, I have an idea. What? Let's make a smoothie. All right, here's what I have. Frozen overripe bananas. I think we're probably supposed, you're probably supposed to peel these before you freeze them because it might be really difficult to get it out now. I didn't even think of that. I have some frozen papaya. And I also have frozen dragon fruit. Moment of truth. <laughs> nice, Al. Go, go, go. <laughs> okay. Get in there. Say a prayer for my blender. <laughs> Yum. Finishing touch. <laughs> Here's our bowls. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Dang. Mm. So cold. <laughs> so we had pretty much the best breakfast ever. It was great. All right, it seems like you want to go back and watch TV so you can go. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. See ya. Okay, and after breakfast was when we finally got to the unboxing of my new pair of Wearable X yoga pants. These pants are smart yoga pants, so you might be like, I don't know what that means, and I definitely felt the same way. Wow, oh, they're soft. There are these embedded pulse points at various areas around the pants. Here, here, and right here. All right, so I've got this device. Make sure it's charged and then find the inside of my leg where I have these three dots. See them? And I'm gonna match up this device with it. Oh, it snapped in. Then you download the app on your phone, and when you open it, it prompts you to connect your device to the phone through Bluetooth. And then you go in and you double tap on the device until you see that it lights up, and that's how you know it's connected to your phone. Connected. <gasps> so on my app, it has all these yoga poses, and I'm gonna select Downward Dog. Downward Dog. Move into a plank pose with your arms shoulder width apart your legs long, and your back flat. Press into your hands and lift your hips to the ceiling. Straighten your arms, but avoid locking your elbows by slightly engaging your biceps. The pants are vibrating. <laughs> and then the purpose of the pulse points on the pants is that the vibrations will guide you on where to focus your attention so that you can move into the pose on your own terms. The app allows users to track their progress and to design their own flow and practice. So there's really a lot you can do with it. I personally prefer doing yoga at a studio out of the house because I love having teachers there to guide me. But I think that these wearable X pants are probably a great alternative when I can't get to class or maybe when I'm traveling and I'm on the road and I wanna be able to do yoga on my own but I still wanna make sure I'm doing it properly. I even put Allie in the pants and let her try them out. We just had a lot of fun. I like the breathable mesh. Ready to do some yoga? Ready! 
But by midday, we had to take them off because I had a very exciting appointment. As you guys know, I got engaged recently to my high school boyfriend, Michael. That sounds like he's in high school currently. He's 26 now, but we met in high school. Our wedding is still a year away, but I made an appointment to try on wedding dresses for the first time. We are at my very first wedding dress try on session. We went to Kleinfeld Bridal in New York City, which is actually where they filmed the TV show Say Yes to the Dress. And I tried on a wide range of dresses. I still don't know exactly what I'm looking for, but there are certain styles that I've pinned on my Pinterest board and I've sent photos up to my mom. So we sort of had an idea of the types of dresses I wanted to try on. And I'm gonna be honest, I did not know what to expect because I've never put on a wedding dress before. Not only that, but I've also just never put on a gown. I was really surprised in that I liked almost everything. <laughs> so now I'm just more confused than when I went in because I don't know what style to look for. And actually, it would be really helpful if you guys would comment below and let me know which one you like the best because then maybe I can just gauge your opinion. Once we left the bridal shop, it was almost 6 p.m. and Allie and I had a nighttime yoga class to get to. As you might know, we do yoga together pretty much every weekend. We always go to our favorite studio, Laughing Lotus. And yesterday there happened to be some event going on in the main lobby and so they were giving away free food and there was body painting. I got my arms painted up and down with some squiggles and glitter. And then we went in for our evening class. I actually wore my Wearable X yoga pants to the class just because they were so comfortable. The class was hard Harder than most, I have to say, it was a pretty sweaty class. That's over. <laughs> Note to self, don't do yoga with bangs out on your forehead because you start to sweat and it's just not good. And then as soon as yoga was over, Allie and I were having a major craving for pasta. So we went to Italy and we got our classic cacio e pepe and penne pomodoro. If you're coming to New York and you want pasta, go to the Italy pizza and pasta bar. So that's it. I just wanted to take you guys into that amazing Saturday because I feel really fortunate to have a twin sister who's my best friend, who lives in my city, who I get to do so many fun things with. And I just wanna share that with you guys. So I hope you guys liked getting a little glimpse into our Saturday and comment below to let me know what other parts of my life you guys wanna take a peek into. Once again, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Click on the little bell in the description box below if you wanna be alerted via email every time a new one of these videos goes up. And give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. See you next time. Bye.